Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be reviewing the Michael Todd Beauty Sonic Blend Brush. This has definitely been floating around on the internet. It's been on the Wendy Williams show. It's been in the Allure magazines and a couple other magazines as well. So this has been talked about a lot. So on the website it says the Sonic Blend is the first of its kind makeup brush to use Sonic technology to apply makeup faster and more powerful than we're hitting makeup brushes. A Sonic Blend applies makeup flawlessly up to four 400 micro movements per second, easily sweeped on foundation, blush, contour, highlight, setting powder, and bronzer without lines or streaks for a natural looking airbrushed like results every time plus sonic blend comes in with a built-in protection against micro contamination so the brush stays cleaner and fresher longer so i'm just going to go ahead and put this to the test we're going to see if i use less makeup and if it applies better than a normal traditional brush I had some trouble getting on my eyelashes today. I tried two different pairs and my eyes are just watering way too much. So the corner of this one is just like sticking out and it's just annoying me. But we're gonna power through this. And if you guys aren't subscribed already, click that subscribe button real quick and let's go ahead and get into this review. Alright, so the first thing I'm going to do is test out to see how well this blends out the foundation. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and push my hair out of the way and I'm going to be using my L'Oreal True Match Lumi. So I'm going to apply this to the face first. And I'm just going to start with half the product that I normally would just to see if this really does use less makeup. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'm just gently gliding this across the face. I'm not really doing anything too special. And so far it is blending beautifully. Alright, so this is just one thin layer of the foundation. And it honestly looks medium to full coverage. And I didn't even use the amount of product that I would to get that coverage. So that is a bonus. I'm pretty impressed. So I'm going to go ahead and move on to adding some contour and highlighting using the same brush. So all I'm going to do is dip in there and then we're going to go ahead and contour the face. So I'm just going to go ahead and highlight underneath my eyes. Then I'm just going to go ahead and clean up my contour. And then I'm going to go ahead and highlight my face as well with this. Alright, so this is the final result. I think my foundation came out so beautiful. I'm seriously shook. You guys, shock to the core. It's, it's, it's literally like hard to like detect my pores or anything. It's just so blended perfectly and everything. Whereas when I use my traditional makeup brushes, I do see my pores a little bit. So I think that's a bonus. I definitely did use way less product. I probably used half the product that I normally would when it came to the foundation. I blended the contour and the highlighter perfectly without caking up. And I was even able to contour my nose with this. I know it's pretty surprising, but you can do it. And this retails for $79 on the website. They also sell it in Sephora, and I'm sure there's a few other places you can find this as well. I think it's really worth it, especially if you don't wanna own a bunch of makeup brushes, you just want one. And it's perfect for traveling because it takes up way less space than bringing like 10 brushes just to do your foundation and bronzer and everything. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave the link down below for you guys to go check out this product. This is a 10 out of 10. Definitely recommend it, you guys. So. so if you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and also click that notification bell so that you are notified as soon as a video goes up. I do post twice a week, Monday and Thursdays for you guys. I did change the date just because it works a little bit better with my schedule, so I'll be posting on Mondays and Thursdays for you guys now. I hope you guys have an amazing day.